Fields of stubble are all that is left in most rice fields across Louisiana. Excellent growing conditions had many farmers looking at a near record crop, but a series of tropical storms reduced yields, especially in North Louisiana. We're probably looking at a slightly above average year uh, overall, just because it was so good for 95% of the harvest of Southwest Louisiana, and we had such great growing conditions. Rice is grown in Southwest and Northeast Louisiana. Yields are higher in the Northeast region, but growers in the Southwest can grow a second or retune crop from the stubble of the first crop. This second crop helps make rice economically viable in Southwest Louisiana. Because we have higher disease pressure, uh, because of our higher temperatures and higher humidity, um, that hurts our first crop, but a lot of the growers make it up in the return crop. So economically, it's kind of even the playing field. Fields in southwest Louisiana are now being flooded to kickstart the crawfish season. LSU Ag Center researchers are trying to determine the economic threshold of when it is worthwhile to harvest a second crop of rice or leave it for crawfish habitat. You're probably somewhere around 10, maybe 12 barrels an acre. Uh, it would justify harvesting that second crop. If the second crop yield appears to be below 10 barrels an acre, not harvesting can be beneficial to crawfish production. Not harvesting the second crop, you have a, a better habitat, better survival, better growth of those crawfish, um, and you tend to catch some of them a little bit earlier in the season at that higher price. Shirley is replicating the study this year to gather more data. With the LSU Ag Center, this is Craig Gotro reporting.